going on on the line. It's nice uh, just to zero in and look at that uh, defensive, offensive line battle that's going on. And there's some hitting happening down in the trenches. There tonight. certainly is. And we'll continue to keep a close eye on the big guy. A stable like this with Cummings and the way Noel's played as well here today. Here's a big pass down the field to Pinto. Travel Pinto, a touchdown. UBC Thunderbirds. Wow. Where did that come from? That was a quick strike, Brent. Yeah, we've been, the last couple of games we've done. Well, what it ends up doing is putting Calgary on the doorstep. Here's Sinagra. And they are going to throw it for the touchdown, diving over. Uh, guess who? Jack McDonald, South Delta Sun Devil alumni. So Calgary knocking on the door here, trailing by one as we begin the third quarter of play. Sinagra wants it all. He's going to the end zone, has a man. Touchdown, Dinos! And that's Klukas with a great catch at the corner of the end zone. That offensive line steward in. Also Antwi for that happening. Here's Antwi with the ball up the middle. Breaks free, sheds the tackle, goes to the far sideline, wants the end zone, and we believe he's in. They indeed signal a touchdown for Antwi. And the Calgary Dinos assuming control here in the third quarter. 22-10 pending the extra point. O'Connor feels the pressure, puts it up in the air, and Morrison makes the catch. They call a touchdown for Alex Morrison, the veteran. What, what, what do you guys have to adopt over the final three games to be the team that can make well, something we just, happen? We just have to execute. Yeah. I, I think it's important that we, we execute on all three. Set. Like we started off our opening kickoff our opening kickoff, we ran it the wrong way. We didn't make the call that would allow for the, and those are those are errors they don't make. And yes, they're more veteran in us, but that doesn't matter. Right now, we need we need to be able to, you know, compete with those guys. 